can you cook? Alexandra here if you are new what it do baby yeah. if you are a returning subscriber How's it? What's up, cuz? What's up? all right so I know I have been missing for a long periodically time but today I am doing a mukbang just gonna chit chat with y'all for a while while I eat I got a pizza from Domino's um, it just has you know cheese alfredo sauce feta cheese and spinach on it. Then I've got this pasta. It's just Alfredo with mushroom in it. Yes, I am still not eating meat. <laughs> Anyways, hey, hey, how y'all doing? address the fact that I have not spoken with you guys in forever and that's just because I simply needed a break um besides everything that's been going on in the world and was things going on in my personal life as well so I just need a break I didn't feel like filming I and on top of that I didn't want to get in front of the camera acting like everything was okay when it wasn't now some of y'all may follow me on um TikTok yes I was posting on there um, hey, I just wanted to have some fun, do little TikTok videos at night <laughs> um, when I couldn't sleep. So, yeah. <laughs> oh, and y'all, if I look, you know, good in the camera or whatever, it's because I got a camera. I got the Canon uh, G7X. I went ahead and purchased me a camera because I was tired of using my phone. Um, Cause you know, it was getting hard out here for a pimp. You know what I'm saying? Um. That's good. I just been at, you know, at the house. I haven't been going nowhere. Just been getting myself together, honestly. I posted on Instagram, though, a couple of times because I got my photos back from a photo shoot that I done. So if you hadn't seen those, go ahead and go on over to my Instagram, which is linked down in the description box. But yeah, if you want to go see those and you haven't, go check those out, child, because they keep me. But I'm back and I'm better. Let's go. Now, the reason I am filming today is because about two months ago, I asked you guys to ask me any questions that you had for me because I wanted to film a Q and A, and I'm gonna do that today. Let's get to know a little bit more about me. I didn't really get that many questions. Have you ever come? Or we still don't answer them. Okay. Um. I got this question a couple times what is my age so I am a young 25 years old I was born in December the day after Christmas to be exact in 1994 <laughs> and I have a twin out there I wasn't born alone I have a twin brother um, that has been on the channel a couple of times now The next question I got was, what is my dream job? Y'all, I have always, excuse me, wanted to be a detective. Like, I watched so much First 48, Cold Case Files, I saw mysteries, like crime shows. I love them. And I have always since, I don't know when, wanted to be a detective. But, town, I'm lazy. <laughs> I'm lazy and I don't like school and yeah but that is my dream job the next question I got was how do you stay confident in yourself y'all my the confidence I have today I had to build that over the years y'all I was extremely when I say extremely insecure when I was younger um just because I've always been the fat kid the plus size girl and stuff like that and so it just I didn't feel good because I always used to think something's wrong with me 
but as I got older, I was just like, nothing's wrong with me. I'm just bigger than, you know, what people consider the normal. Um, and I just learned to, you know, I just was like, either I'm going to change it or embrace it. And I decided to embrace it. I, I do want to lose weight though, but I'm going to embrace that because it's who I am. And if I don't love me, I can't expect nobody else to love me. Come on, tell them. What, I mean, you know what I mean? So that's just how I remain confident. Like, and it all comes with knowing who you are, getting to know yourself, you know, things like that. I had to get to know me and I'm still getting to know me. So that's how I remain confident by knowing who I am and just, you know, accepting me and just, that's pretty much it. Um, next question is, what is my favorite color? Rose gold, y'all. Rose gold is my favorite color. Cool. Like that. So nasty. And that's what happened. So rude. Did y'all see that? No. <laughs> but yeah, rose gold is my favorite color. Love it. It's just so pretty. Um. Yeah. A little cream mango. The next question I got is, how are you so fine? Oh my god! Wow! Sis, you think I'm fine, sis? Girl, thank you. Thank you, girl. I just, you know, first of all, I just want to give all the honor and glory to God because, you know, He created this. Okay? You know, besides genetics, it started with Him. Okay. <laughs> okay, so shout out to God and my parents. <laughs> Oh, I'm so childish. But yeah, thank you, girl. Though. Thank you. Thank you, girl. Yeah, I need to eat. I'm serious talking so much. I ain't eating. could listen to for forever. Um, hmm. Hmm. So we'll do it like this. Back in the day, More Than I Can Bear by Kirk Franklin. That was the one I absolutely loved. And now I listen to Never Lost make sure I'm telling y'all this by the right person. I just know that Chandler Moore sang it. Um, who was never lost by? Um, uh, All Nation <clears throat> Worship Assembly. Never lost. That's my current one. Like, play it, like, every day. Like, love it. So, yeah. It says, can you sing? No, a little bit, sis. A little bit, you know. I got a little song, song, you know. Yeah, I can sing. Can you cook? I'll say this, if I have a recipe to follow, like, you know, like some of these people just naturally have it. They can go in there, they ain't gotta measure nothing, they ain't gotta, you know what I'm saying? Me, I have to follow a recipe if I'm gonna cook something. So, yeah, yes and no. I'll leave it at that. <laughs> Are you single? Child, yes, been single. Don't know how much longer I'm gonna be single. Just, you know, I gave that to God and we're just living and whatever happens, happens. That's where I'm at. Cause it used to really bother me. Cause I've been single my whole life or whatever and I'm like 25. Um, but yeah, it really used to bother me, but just, you know, more recently, I'm starting to just be like, you know, if God calls me to a life of singleness, I'm going to have to be okay with that. And I'm going to be okay, you know, and then if he just happens to send somebody my way, then that's fine too. <laughs> so yeah, Mexico or Dubai. Definitely Dubai. I've always wanted to go there. I have watched so many Dubai vlogs here on the tube because I got to get there one day. No, they soon. <laughs> Too much going on. Not going anywhere. I barely want to leave my house. 
But yeah, most definitely the bow. What inspired you to start YouTube and makeup? Okay. I start with makeup first. So I did not start wearing makeup till prom. It was 2013, June of 2013, first time I ever really wore makeup. Um yeah. And so like the girl and Mac did my face and I just fell in love and like I started watching YouTube. Um I think the very first YouTube I ever watched who did makeup was Shirley B. Any Yang, I wanna say that's how you say her last name. I just know she's a UK YouTuber. And I'm thinking I watched her do the Rihanna uh, what's my name makeup look from her that video the what's my name video and I just fell in love I was like oh my god you can do so much with makeup and so it just went uphill from there like I just started getting into everything I'm not gonna lie my makeup was horrible when I first started doing it like I wore concealer too light um didn't know what contour or bronzer or none of that was like oh my makeup was awful now that I think about it I don't have any pictures because I don't ran through so many phones since then I wish I did I would insert them but yeah but what inspired me to do YouTube I'd rather say who inspired me to do YouTube Shirley B. Eniang, um Vicky Logan Ashley D. Devonna she used to be Ashley D. Beauty but yeah now she's Ashley Devonna um who else did I watch Tierra Monet yes Ma'am, love her. She is an OG, okay? Um, if you don't know who that is, look her up. She's amazing. Um, Tierra Monet. Oh, Jackie Anna. Back when her name was, was it Makeup Game on Point, I want to say? Yeah, Jackie Anna. So those were the five people that I started off watching doing makeup on YouTube or just being an influencer on YouTube, period. And I just fell in love. And it took me a while to gain the confidence to actually sit in front of the camera and film the what, um, in addition to the who inspired me. Um, I didn't see a lot of representation of plus size women on YouTube. I don't see a lot. Like I see it, but I don't see a whole, whole lot of it. And so I just decided, you know, let me add some more flavor <laughs> to YouTube. So yeah, that's another thing that inspired me. I just didn't see a lot of plus size representation. And, and the ones that we do have are great. Okay, the corner white. Um, well, that's my top one. Um, Chrissy B. Styles, who I love. She's a newer YouTuber. I think I've been watching her in the last year or so. Um, what else do I watch that is plus size? I can't think right now. But yeah, we do have some plus size greats on here. But yeah, I just didn't see a lot of representation, so I decided to go ahead and do it as well. That was my what, if, you know, besides my who. And the last question I believe I got is what's a goal for 2020? Honestly, child. Okay, so on a, on a social media end, a goal that I have um is to reach 5,000 subscribers before the year is up and to just grow across all my social media um youtube instagram um twitter just grow <laughs> just grow more um cousins um you know just grow and gain a loyal audience who's gonna stick with me and watch me and support me and I do the same um so shout out to y'all cousins who was watching this here we almost said 3,000 cousins okay I looked I've been looking I know y'all been seeing me replying to comments and stuff but not posting but yeah I've been looking I see y'all I see y'all comments I'm replying I'm parting them and all that um but yeah that's that's a goal I would have to just to grow as an influencer and I'll reach it you know what I'm saying I just gotta speak those things that be not as though they were, okay? And so I will reach 5,000 subscribers by the end of the year. I will grow as an influencer across all platforms. And that's all the questions I got. I didn't really get that many questions, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, dang, I got all these cousins that don't know, none of them really wanna know nothing about me. It's cool. If you guys have any other questions for me besides the one that I've answered today, you know, just DM me on Instagram, on Twitter, have you wanna reach out to me. 
But yeah, that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Like I said, if you have any other questions, just hit me up on you know Twitter or Instagram, and I'll be more than happy to answer it. Or if you want me to do a part two of this video, let me know that as well. But of course, if you made it this far, then you already know, baby girl, <laughs> we're family. Hey, Auntie. So, cousin, I need you to like, comment, subscribe, share, hit that bell so you can turn on your post notifications and be notified every single time I upload. I love you guys, and I will see you in my next video.